Hello, Reagan here. Okay, so my apologies. I'm trying so hard to stick to a two videos a week schedule. It is a little bit difficult for me uh, just because life and everything else. I'm also in the process of trying to get back to live streaming, but uh, the main reason why I've been so like um, off with everything lately is because I've been trying to get um, things squared away. We've had a lot of like internet issues and stuff here. I, right now I'm, I've got a new tower. So that's helping. It's not a new tower. It's actually a hand-me-down from my oldest son because he just bought a new computer, but his low, low end old computer does way more than I need. Um, I do have Macs, I have a Mac, actually I have a MacBook and a iMac, but um, there's a lot of limitations and stuff when it comes to like actual recording and using like OBS and live streaming, especially, uh, editing on there is fantastic, but everything else is kind of a little bit too, uh, I mean, for me personally, it's kind of hard to do, uh, especially with like the, the, um, laptop because with my MacBook Air, it's got limited ports. And even with the more expensive adapters, there's only so many things I can plug in. <laughs> and I um, uh, I use a lot of peripherals. So it's been a little bit of a stretch, but we have that straightened out now. I have an actual PC, uh, which makes it a lot easier for me to plug in all the things and use like my Scarlett with my microphone and to use my camera and, you know, all that fun stuff. For a while, I was using my iPhone with OBS on my Mac, which was great, except for the part where every time I got a phone call or a notification, it would completely bump me out of recording. And that was getting really frustrating. And obviously that wouldn't work for streaming, but I have all that squared away now and it's getting better. And now I am... Like I said, slowly getting back to it. The goal is to have uh, two videos out a week. And uh, yeah, so right now I'm working on, <laughs> I'm working on my camel. So uh, I'm going to include some footage at the end of this video of me building the camel's tail. Uh, I am terrible with clay and it looks like the camel was having an accident when I got done, <laughs> but I started putting some paint on this poor camel and it is getting much better. Um, if you would like to, you could um, hop down to the comments down below and help me pick out a name for this camel because I have no idea what to name it. And um, yeah, so like I said, I just have like base paint layers down. I got a long ways to go as far as painting it goes, but I did get the camel primed and it got the camel started and uh, it's gonna be a fabulous camel when it's done. And its tail's not going to uh, stand out as much as it did when I first put it on. Poor camel. And this camel came from my grandmother's yard. Uh, my grandmother passed away a couple years ago and her property, she was kind of a hoarder and uh, she had a bunch of stuff outside and this camel was one of the things that she had outside in her yard. My uncle, um, rescued the camel minus its tail. And like I said, I had to put a tail together for it, which I did. And, uh, I said, I now I'm just giving it some paint and, uh, fixing it up because it was really chipped really bad and stuff. And I wanted to make sure that it was well sealed. I ended up sealing it with, um, uh, an acrylic primer as well as a mixture of black paint and Mod Podge. So it's like the gray, gray primer and the black primer, uh, mixed together gives me a darker gray. And seals it really well so I don't have to worry about, you know, any issues or anything. Um, and it's also making it a lot easier because I'm using like apple barrel paints. Uh, actually, it has some apple barrel and some like uh, Craft Smart. Uh, and they're not very pigmented, so it takes several layers. And so it's even worse when it's soaking up a lot of paint on top of you know, a lot of layers, but since I sealed it really good, uh, I'm not having to waste as much paint trying to get at least the initial layers laid down. So, um, yeah, that's what I'm working on right now. Uh, I have a lot of other things, uh, to work on. I also want to do a little bit of like a, uh, a little bit of a haul video and show you some of the miniatures I got for my dollhouse and a few other things I have going on. But yeah, I'm just really, really, really bad about uploading. So uh, here's my camel, f <laughs> camel footage. <laughs> and uh, I will see you again before the end of the week. Check out my links. I also have my Patreon up and all that fun stuff. And uh, yeah, if you hop over there and sign up, you'll be, um, you'll get some mini mail from me and uh, I'll be sending out postcards and random surprise packages to my patrons. Uh, yeah, and all that fun stuff. And yeah, so do the thing. There's links in the description down below. And I will see you next time. <laughs>